Hey, this is Nature Boy here, your favorite environmentalist, and I'm going to give you my version of offshore drilling. This container of water right here, it is symbolic of an ocean body of water three miles outside of your favorite beach line. This blue bucket, it is an oil rig three miles outside of your favorite beach line. Now, while the technology is superb as it pertains to offshore drilling, you got to account for human error. Now, I do know when I'm on an airplane, there is no room for human error. But in this business, I guess it's acceptable, like blowouts, collisions, and even just people just sleeping on the job. Now, I think it's time for a little bit of human error. Up, oh, collision. Now, as this oil spew out into our ocean waters, did you know that 97% of all oil spills are about 1,000 barrels or less? But did you know that if it's 1,000 barrels or less, it doesn't even have to be reported? Is that per day, per week, per month? Hmm. But I do know that only 5 to 15% of that oil is cleaned up, leaving a high percentage floating on our waters. I'm quite sure it has to go somewhere, like to our shoreline, especially after a big storm. Now I do know, when I was a kid, I used to love to go to the beach and swim, and of course, I always would accidentally swallow the water. Now I wanna ask you this question. Would you or would you want your family to swim in or drink this? 